Hi guys, and today's math lesson is still with fractions, but this time fractions with food. So I had a whole clementine and I unpeeled it and let's see how many equal parts we have. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So we have nine total equal parts, our denominator. Now let's say I eat one. What fraction of the clementine did I eat? Well, what part did I eat? I only had one. So I ate one nine of the clementine. Now let's say I give three away from sharing with my sister. She gets three. Well, I had nine total pieces. And I want to know what fraction of the clementine is left. Well, I gave three away. Let's see how many are left. One, two, three, four, five. Only five ninths of the clementine are left. So let's see what other food I have. I also have a chocolate bar. So how many total equal parts are in this chocolate bar? Four, so that's our denominator. Our total number of equal parts is four. Now let's say my mom's hungry. So I'm gonna give her What part? Oh, you guys can't say. I give her two pieces. So, what part of the candy bar, or what fraction of the candy bar did I give my mom? So I had four total equal parts. Give my mom two. What fraction of the candy bar did I give my mom? Well, the part I'm looking for is the part I gave away. So I gave her two fourths. And how many do I have left? I still have two fourths left, so half really. But let's say maybe you don't like chocolate. Maybe you like Skittles. Oh. Okay, the Skittles went a little lower. So here's my set of Skittle, right? We talked about part of a whole like a whole candy bar or a whole clementine. And now we have part of a set, a set of Skittles. But we still are gonna have a numerator, our part, and we're still gonna have a denominator, our total. So in this question, I wanna know what fraction of the Skittles are yellow. So that's what we're going to find out. What fraction of the Skittles are yellow? So to find our total, our denominator, we have to count all the Skittles. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 12, 13, 14, 15. So I have 15 Skittles, and now, it might be hard for you guys to see. Maybe if I move it. So I have 15 Skittles, and I wanna see, well, how many are yellow? But, so my denominator is 15, because that is the total number of Skittles. I have 15 total Skittles, and now my part is, what fraction of them are yellow? So now I'm only gonna count the yellow ones. One, two, Three, four, five, six. So, six fifteenths are yellow. Now I'm gonna put them back. Put them back in my set. 
What if I want to know what fraction of the Skittles are orange? So here's the question. Is my denominator going to change? Think about it. Or is the total number of Skittles I have going to change? No, my denominator is still 15 because I still have 15 Skittles in this set. Is my part going to change? Is my numerator going to change? Yes, because I, now I'm looking for how many orange Skittles there are. So one, two, three, four. So four. 15s are orange. Now, do I have more? Is the frac, do I have more yellow or more orange? Skittles. Yellow, because there are more yellow than there are orange. Now, let's try it with. See what else I have? I have some gummy bears. So let's see what fraction of the gummy bears are. And let's find out how many are green. So we want to figure out what fraction of the gummy bears are green. Well, to find my total or to find my denominator, I have to know how many total gummy bears do I have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I have seven total gummy bears. And how many are green? That's the part, the numerator I'm looking for. Well, I have one, two, three. Three green gummy bears. So three sevenths of the gummy bears are green. Now, I'm going to switch it up on you. Oops. What if I want to know what fraction of the gummy bears are not green? Okay, well, what colors do I have? Well, I have green, red, and I have white. I want to figure out what fraction of the gummy bears are not green. Well, to find my total denominator, same thing. How many total gummy bears do I have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I still have seven gummy bears, except now I want to know what fraction are not green. So I'm kind of like going to move the green ones away. And now I'm just going to count up everything that's not green. One, two, three, four. So four sevenths of the gummy bears are not green. They're either red or they're white. So four sevenths of the gummy bears are not green. And this is, we're working with a set because these are a set of gummy bears. And when we're working with a chocolate bar, right? This is part of a whole because this is a whole chocolate bar. So let's, let's go back to Part of the whole. So let's say what fraction of the so here's my chocolate bar. And it is broken up into one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine total pieces. So that's going to be my denominator. So I have nine total pieces. And then some friends come along. And I give them one, two, three, four, five pieces of my chocolate bar. They want to know what fraction of the chocolate bar is left. So I gave one, two, three, four, five pieces away. What fraction of the chocolate bar is left? Well, one, two, three, four, four ninths of my chocolate bar is left. 
for me, for me to eat later. So, last but not least, I do have one more snack. And it's part of a set, a set of some m &Ms. And we want to find out what fraction of the M&Ms are blue. So to find our total, or to find our denominator, we have to find out how many M&Ms are there in all. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. That's 14 altogether. Our denominator, our total. And what is the numerator going to be? It's the part we're looking for. Well, this is asking blue. So the part is blue. Our numerator is going to be how many M&Ms are blue? Well, there's only one, two. Only two blue M&Ms. So only two fourteenths of the M&Ms are blue. So hopefully you enjoyed this fraction lesson with food. Maybe you saw your favorite snack. Maybe I made you hungry. Uh, but comment and let me know that you watched this video.